Hello everyone, welcome to Jayla Makes. I'm Jayla and this is my dad here. Hello everyone and welcome to part two, which is day eight of growing your butterflies at home. Now Jayla, today we're gonna focus on the different parts of the caterpillar. So Jayla, there are three parts of a caterpillar. You can tell everybody at home what those are. Abdomen, thorax and head. Correct, there are three main parts. And what is your, you, you were giving me that fun fact. What is your fun fact of the day? Fun fact, did you know that usually caterpillars have 16 legs? 16 legs, and you said that they usually, so some, sometimes they could have 14 as well. So, you know, it's a very interesting fact about caterpillars. Now, did you know, Jayla, that these legs have names? Now, the ones which are attached to the abdomen, Jayla, are called the prolegs. And, and the front legs are called the true legs. And they are attached to the thorax, Jayla, which is very interesting. Now, that Jayla. Is. The, the prolegs are the ones which help the caterpillar move around and they've got these special little barbs that act like Velcro which allow them to stick to the branches and stick to the leaves which is, very, which is also a very interesting fact and something that we also learnt today. Now Jaina, let's have a closer observation. What can you see? They have, and I can see some silk um, threads, and also they have got very large. You know, can you remember when it was day one, they were very small and they were just twitching. Now have a look at them, Jayla. It looks to me that they've gone about five or even six or seven times larger. That is just fascinating. Eight days, Jayla. That is such a short time and they've grown. Now, you can see that they've got their silk. Now, there's two reasons why these caterpillars um, create silk. Now, the first reason is for defense, everybody. Now, guys, caterpillars need to hide away from birds and other insects because the other insects, Jayla, will want to eat them. Also, they spin this um, silk so that the other insects don't, that's the first barrier that they need to get through. And then it will give the caterpillars time to kind of wriggle out. Isn't that just a fantastic fact, Jayla? Wow. Now, there we go. And we are now, Jayla, waiting for them to grow larger and for them to find their way onto the next stage. Do you know what the next stage is after they, after they start growing? They turn into chrysalis and then they change to a butterfly. And that is something that we are both looking forward to. Do you to. want to 